Guys, my name is Nigel. Hey, mate. And what's your name? Uh, Josh. Oliver. Oliver and Josh. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so guys, your thoughts on the afterlife? Um, the afterlife is uh, something that I think about quite a bit, actually. Uh, okay. And it's, it's a difficult concept for me. Because yeah. uh, I think about people who take, uh, take comfort in religion, you know, Christians, you know, heaven and hell. Okay. But I think existing forever is something that I would struggle to imagine. But then also, I can't really fathom, you know, not existing and, you know, just darkness and nothing. Mm. So it's, uh, it's a difficult concept for me to think about, but uh, yeah, I don't know about you all. I, li I like okay. to think there's something up there. I like to think there's reincarnation, you know, something like uh, some sort of animal. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I mean, uh, in all honesty, I hope, I hope it's not a Christian one, because me being a homosexual, that wouldn't, that wouldn't go very, that wouldn't go very well. I, are you a homosexual? Yes, yeah. All right, uh, This okay. is not my boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, my no, friend. no, that's yeah, not All right, all right. okay. Yeah. Hey. Um, so, yeah, I just, I just hope there's something, but, yeah. Mm. Yeah. All, all right, okay. Uh, we are presented with different kinds of truths every day, you know, but they must be surely one absolute truth. You yeah. know, and uh, it's good to have a, a thought about the afterlife, but it's good to go the extra mile and do more homework because where you are going is eternity. Yeah. Mm. You know, uh, it, it is appointed that once you are born, one day you will die and you check out. And according to those who are Christians in the faith, they say it is appointed that one is born once and after that judgment. You know, yeah. I myself am a Christian, so... Are you, uh, are you, uh, what, what denomination would you say? I, I would say I follow Jesus. Oh, just, you know, yeah. fair, fair enough. Man. Because yeah. uh, that's what it's all about, following Jesus. Uh, denominations and religions are there to divide people cause confusion, cause wars, manipulate, you know, all the drama, they come, you know, but God never had in mind a religion. He wanted a personal relationship with everyone. Yeah. Now, uh, let me start with him, since you say, uh, you know, if you say you are a homosexual, yeah. one who does homosexuality and one who lies, or one who steals, yeah. sin is sin. Yeah. according to the Bible. So it's no point of judging people to say, hey, you're homosexual, we yeah, are this and that. Because at the end of the day, a wrong is wrong. The one who says don't lie is the one who says don't steal. You understand? Yeah. Now, the Bible says everyone has sinned. So we have all sinned. Homosexual, liar, a thief. If we are going to perish, we all go to the same hell. But God sent a savior, Jesus. Have you read about Jesus? Uh, I have read about Jesus. I know. Okay. Do you know why he came to die on the sins for for the sins of the people? He died for. I mean, sins. Do, you, do you know why he came? He died for our sins, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Now, if he is dead for your sins, why don't you just repent and then live for him? Yeah. I, I, I know. I know. Yeah. We should. We should pay more attention to it. And you know what? What he's what he's done. Okay. Yeah. Now, do you know when he, when you are going to die? No. I don't know that. You don't, I don't know. think anyone knows that. Uh, nobody knows, yeah. But people die every day. Some die young, some they die when they are old, mm. you know. But is it not more important to, to do your homework and make sure that you are right with God now? Because maybe today, if you check out, you, you need to know where you are going. Exactly. Yeah. yeah? So uh, going to you, you said you, are, you, you believe that there is something. According to the Bible, which I use because I'm a Christian, to go to heaven is easy. Receive Jesus. That is the qualification for free. Yeah. You don't need to pay any money. You just put your trust in him. Repent of your sins. Lord Jesus, forgive me for all my sins. Write my name in the book of life. The Bible says once you repent, he gives you a new life and you begin to live for him. Once you live in him, once you've started living in him, you live with one commandment, love. Because when you live in love, you don't want to do evil to others. You treat others like you want to be treated. Love covers the whole commandments. In love, there's no lying, there's no stealing, and every no. other evil. Even if a man is loving a man? Uh, with that one, a man loving another man, you should... Which Bible verse have you read? Uh, uh, a couple. A couple. I, I wouldn't say I've read it, you know. A Can man cover, should not lie back. with a man, or it is uh, abomination. Can, can I show you one verse? You know, is it okay? What's it? What's it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, a man should not lie with a man as one does a woman. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me 
show you one. But let me just go on uh, Genesis. How often do you read your Bible? Um, uh, not enough for a long time. Okay, if you go to Genesis chapter 19, it speaks of God sending two angels to a place called Sodom. Hmm. And when he came there, he saw a man by the name of uh, Lord, and he had two daughters. Yeah? So if I fast forward, uh, hear what it says here. So when two visitors visited him, they came to his door, the men of Sodom. Yeah. And he pressed upon them greatly. Okay. And they turned into unto him and entered into his house, and he made them a feast and did bake on uh, bread, uh -huh. and they did eat. Yeah. So if if you if, if you look to where you read. It's, it's the next few verses that I want you to, to read. Yeah. Kian! Nay, hey, God power is a fellow. Eh? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, let's read from verse number 19. Keep going. Can you see? Yeah, you read that. Am I reading? Uh, uh, no, you can. Okay, you come next to me. Yeah, yeah, go on, mate. All right, okay. Yeah. Okay, and he, okay, but before they lay down, the so, men of the so, city. So, so two men, the two angels, yeah. they visited this man by the name of Lord. Oh, yeah. And before they went to bed, this is where we are now reading, okay? But before they lay, uh -huh. before they lay, the men of the city, even the men of the Sodom, compassed the house. They surrounded the house. Uh, both old and young, all both the old and young. from each quarter. Mm. And they called unto Lot and uh, said unto him, yeah. uh, when are the men which came into the uh, this came night. into the this night? Yeah, so where are the two men that came to you to visit you? Exactly. Where are them? Uh -huh. So this is the, this, the city of Sodom, yeah. the men, the young and the old call in to say we want to see those men. Uh -huh. Continue. Uh, the, this night, uh, bring no, them. No, yeah, six. Yeah. Oh yeah, and the lot when uh, so went out. okay, he says, uh, bring them out unto us, unto us, uh, that we may know them, that we might sleep. Oh, them. is that what we're thinking? Yeah. So they might be doing nefarious things. They they, they they called to say those two visitors. We want to know them. Want to sleep with them. So bring them out here. So do you not think that it's wrong? Uh, continue. Says, oh, and said, I pray. So he I said, pray you. I pray, I beg you. Uh huh. Uh, do not yeah, so man. wickedly, so don't to not do it. Don't do it, don't do it so wickedly. Uh -huh. Now continue to hear. Uh, behold, now I have two doors which have not known man. Let me. Uh, I have let two me. virgin girls. Yes. They've never known so he, a man. Oh, yes. Yeah, so Rather gonna, take so my two so daughters. Oh. But as for this man, it's wickedly. Mm. But not only this one verse, if we had time, I can show you more verses because the reason why I want to show you these scriptures is so that when you look at one scripture, another scripture, another scripture, you then come to a place where you conclude what yes. does God say about this? Because for many people, they just know one verse which you say, oh, it is just written that you should not lie with a man. But you must read in context and understand many of the scriptures. Now, if you have read something like this, if you have your own house and you, you tell your friend to say, guys, anyone who, enter who wants to enter my house, they must take off their shoes. They must take off their shoes. If someone refuses to take off their shoes, will you allow them in? Uh, the uh, no. no. No, isn't it? Yeah, so, exactly. if God says, guys, all of you repent and then you can enter my heaven and we spend eternity for free. Exactly. Are you gonna? Okay. I, I know sex well, I really is good. Like men. I know sex is good. Yeah. But yeah after yeah, yeah. all the sex that you can have, yeah. if you live long, you might live for hundred years. How old are you now? Uh, sixteen. Sixteen. Maybe another hundred years and hundred and sixteen. Then maybe you pass on. Yes. But where you are going? Hundred and sixteen years is it? Is it? It's drop? very minuscule. Yes, compared to. Why would you want to risk? Oh, well, you that? said you, you said you you stress the importance of love, but I don't I don't like women like that. Oh, okay, how how this guy does? All right, how, how did you become gay? Can I, is it okay if I ask you that? You what happened? Him? No. What happened? <laughs> um, I don't know. What happened? Sort of guys. I was like, yeah, bit of me that. Okay, you just saw on uh, internet. 
Uh, a bit of both. A bit of both. Yeah. Okay. Now, wh what we see and what we are introduced to sometimes will give us a. I'll say addictions mm. and some cravings, sometimes which are not right. Yes. Now, I would think it's very homosexual. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But, but you, 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 you were not born homosexual. Uh, I don't know, but well, I, I wasn't born straight evil, so I don't know. I don't know. I wasn't born heterosexual, so I don't know what I was born. Do, do you do you know that? I don't, I don't believe I was born anything, to be honest. Oh, oh, do you know that demons are real? I didn't know that. You don't know that. I, I, I don't. Yeah, I don't know that. Or, uh, you know. Okay. Uh, maybe. I, I have prayed for people and cast de them demons. Oh, have it's, you? Yeah, I can show you a, vi a video on my phone where I'm doing that. Well, well. The I'll... reason why I'm saying it is because there are two kingdoms. There's the kingdom of light and the kingdom of darkness. Mm. So you can be set free. The, the only way to find out is I can pray for you. If those demons leave you, I'm sure you will see that, oh, there is something about these girls that you would yield again back. To, because if you I'd say. Beg. Be, huh? I'd beg for the women. Uh, no, 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 you need one, not the men. I just want. Yeah, you yeah, obviously yeah, okay. have one. Okay. So, the, the only way to know if something is influencing you is to receive prayer. Yes. Why are you laughing? This is serious conversation, John. Sorry, we don't know where our mates have gone. Yeah. yeah. Hey, do you want to say something? You know what? No, no. But what I'm saying to him, does it make sense? Can I yeah, show you a verse? Sense. Let me show you this verse. All right. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. Uh, we just need to go and find our mates, but it was lovely having a chat with you. Yo, I'm going to go read Genesis. Yo, I think that's the best part of the Bible, the Genesis. What do you think of Exodus? Not as good. <laughs> it's not as good. Oh, um, oh, oh, okay, can I just pray for you before you go? Yes. Okay, Give correct. me your hand. What, what's your full name? Uh, Oliver Boyle. Oliver Boyle. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray, Father, for Oliver Boyle. Lord, when he starts his journey in the Bible, I pray that you give him understanding. In the name of Jesus Christ. And I take authority against everything that has been raised against him to hinder his life, to destroy his life. I pray, Lord, that you give him understanding in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. I, I pray that God will give you, you understanding, man. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Blessed and, be. Uh, nice talking to you, man. Yeah, thank you for being patient. Yeah, uh, is it okay if I have the mic back? Yeah. 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 I, don't forget. Yeah, yeah, I, I, man, read, read, the, read the book of John. I'll uh, read the book of John. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, will. I will. What's your YouTube channel name? Can, can, I, can I give you? Arise and shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. And as you go, preach, saying, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Heal the sick, cleanse the lepers, raise the dead, cast out devils. Freely we have received, freely we give. 